you guys welcome to your weekend edition love in general reading this is for the element of earth uh, so if you are Taurus Virgo Capricorn Sun Moon Rising these messages are for you for the weekend of December 13th through the 15th 2019 um, so I want to thank you guys for all your love and support uh, to my channel. I ask that you all please continue to do so. Remember, these are general, so they may or may not resonate, but hopefully they give you some clarity. Um, if you guys want to book a personal or private reading, be sure to email tamajtarot at gmail.com. That information is in the description box. Um, if you want to reach me by phone, that's a different process. I normally post notifications when I'm taking calls. Um, and then if you want to support me or my channel, uh, you can visit Patreon um, or if you're interested in the tarot classes, uh, that is also on my Patreon. So make sure to check out all that information below. Um, so here we have Central Issue, Heart of the Matter, the High Priestess, the Emperor, we have the Tower. We have the King of Coins, Seven of Swords, Ten of Cups, Ten of Pentacles, and the Sun. Okay, so you guys look as if there could have been some sort of unexpected changes or unexpected happenings in your life. Uh, you could have made some sort of realization I feel like for some of you, uh, you may be breaking tradition or you, I'm seeing some sort of laws being broken or someone doing something based off of their intuition. It's just like, someone is just like, man, forget what the laws say or forget how things are supposed to be done. Um, I'm, I'm, I have a hunch that I need to do this or I have a hunch I need to do that. So I feel like you're breaking the rules um, to get what you want. And I feel like it works out in your favor. Um, maybe you were trying to be patient about something. Um, like you have to go through the process. It's like, well, you're supposed to go through this process and then you go through these steps and all of that. And then something is like, you know what? No, let's bypass all of that. And it's like you are going straight to the top it definitely looks like you uh cut corners or you um you took some sort of shortcut to get what you want wanted um i feel like there was some sort of like you had to do something underhanded to get what you wanted um, I do see something like cheating. I don't know whether you had to cheat to pass a test. You had to uh, lie about your finances. You had to lie to to get uh, to portray some sort of image so that you could get the person that you wanted. Maybe you lied and said, oh, you know, I do this, that and the other. Or, yes, I have a home here, there. And but, you know, maybe it's you lied about your image or, you know, keep in mind the story can go be flipped. So maybe um is this is happening to you like someone around you has been covering up their whole identity and you know just something's very someone used deception to get what they want and i can't remember who had a similar message last week um so it's like yeah someone had to lie to get what they wanted now i mean on a negative side it does look like if someone is in a relationship they are sneaking sneaking around or hiding something or someone has a whole nother family somewhere um so be careful because it does look like someone is withholding some sort of information i'm seeing something rule out in your favor though something like you earth are going to have the best of both worlds i feel like this weekend is about you being emotionally um fulfilled as well as uh, financially fulfilled or having some sort of materialism um that gives you stability i feel i, I see security like you're securing something in a bag you're securing your future um 
Now this also may have something to do with taking some sort of secret trip or secret plans. You might be planning on doing something in secret. Um, you could be involved in a relationship where it might not necessarily be cheating, but it is secret. Or maybe you're hiding someone from your family um, or your family is hiding something from you. Um, I even see someone maybe offering to pay you to do something to do their dirty work. It's like, I will pay you to do this for me. Like I'll pay you to, to lie for me, or I'll pay you to do this, that, and the other. So I feel like someone is being paid to do someone's dirty work. <coughs> um, I feel like too, like just overall, this central issue is about listening to your intuition. You may have to make some sort of decision and you you really have to go with your gut. Um, you may be very intuitive over the weekend or something may um, manifest from a dream. Something comes into fruition. I'm seeing something that was just a feeling or something that was just a thought actually will materialize. Um, I'm also seeing the possibility of someone stepping down from position, leaving their job, or just getting fired from their job, especially if someone works for a big corporation or the government. I feel like someone could be laid off or fired or quitting. Um, but I feel like somebody's being paid for, like you're being compensated if that happens, because maybe something just isn't at, you're not at fault for something. Um, man, I, I just see so many things happening. I see the truth coming out. I feel like you're gonna have clarity. I feel like good news is on the way. Some of you may feel like you found a soulmate some of you are going into business with your lover. It's like you guys are just not only lovers, but your business partners. I see something really standing out in regards to maybe family business or something like um, family affair. It's a family affair. It's a family affair. So I feel like something is like, maybe you learn some sort of secret about your family. Maybe you learn something, um, that something runs in a family, like some sort of ability, some sort of gift. Um, maybe you find out that you're related to someone that you had no clue that you were related to them. And it's just like, what, we're related? You might find out that you're, you might find out that your partner is your distant relative, um, and you guys are like, I don't care. I'm not telling anybody. I'm carrying on with this relationship, and we just gonna pretend like we didn't notice. Um, I can see that happening. <laughs> um, I also feel like something may be revealed about a son or somebody's son. Hmm. I also feel that you are connecting with your divine counterpart. This looks like mother, father of spirituality, high priestess and the emperor. Uh, I have been looking at him as the hierophant all this time. I was getting straight hierophant energy from him. It's the emperor energy. I still feel like the messages apply. It's just that this is someone who is more definitely about entrepreneurship, business, business minded. Um, I feel like this person is a strategist. I still feel like someone is breaking the law or breaking the rules to get what they want or to get ahead in life or to get ahead in a relationship. Um, 
What was I getting ready to say? Oh, uh, I feel like someone also secretly wants to be a father. Or you may find something out in regards to a secret pregnancy, like uh, an addition to the family. But these still look like divine masculine and divine feminine to me. Um, this person is just very alpha male and she's coming off as the receptive uh, feminine divine feminine you know she she receives um this is someone both of these energies together interact with each other very naturally i feel hmm something that's coming off is like a perfect image someone is the perfect image um, it may be that someone is viewing you as a trophy piece or someone thinks you're their ideal husband or wife. Let me see what this Seven of Swords is. So for some of you, this secrecy has something to do with a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Either there's a fire sign observing you or you are observing a fire sign or someone that has like strong fire energy. Um, I also feel like someone, the Seven of Swords is about someone um, making some sort of secret plans. Uh, I don't want to say secret attack because I don't want it to seem like, you know, like a war but it is kind of like something is secret in a way someone's getting ready to approach something or someone. Hmm. I also feel like there are several people involved in some sort of situation. Everybody's in on it. These people are in on somebody's secret. Somebody is playing alone. Uh, man, that's weird. Um, okay, so I almost got a situation where somebody is helping other people. Somebody is helping somebody either surprise, to surprise somebody, like they're all in on it. That's, I'm gonna leave it at that. I just feel like everybody's in on it, but, but you, or you are in on some sort of secret plans, but this other person doesn't know. Something's going to be brought to your attention. I feel like something's going to be revealed. Something's going to be put in the spotlight. I feel like you're going to be successful too, or someone's going to be successful with these plans. Um, I feel like just as a side note, whatever is going on in your life, like you're going to have success. I feel like you're going to have success in love and finances and health. Oh, I hear my son singing. I'm sorry. <laughs> Let me not get distracted. Um, so, yeah, the, I feel like, too, someone is trying, it's very hard for someone to keep some sort of secret and they can't wait for it to be over. They're like, I cannot wait for this secret to end because I don't know how much longer I can keep my mouth shut. So someone is making some sort of plans around you or you are making plans around somebody. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if like people are trying to find out your whereabouts. Um, and it sounds, maybe it catches you off guard because it just seems like normal conversation to you. But really someone is trying to find out where you're going to be. 
Um, are you supposed to be going somewhere? What's your schedule like? Like someone is spying for somebody is what I'm getting. Um, but it's, I feel like it's for a good cause. Oh, and then a six of cups fell out. So <laughs> I think someone's planning a surprise. I, even let's say if somebody was pregnant, it's like, let's not tell anybody. Let's let's wait until this, the, let's wait until the whole family is together and then we'll tell them that we're engaged or we're having a baby um, or something of that so sort. Um, let's look at the sun. It could be a surprise engagement. Someone could surprise you with a home, like something could be handed down or maybe somebody pays something off for you, pays off a debt for you or just buys you a gift or I don't know. I feel like regardless, it's a positive outcome. Some of you may have demolished your homes and rebuilt it. Hmm. The sun may have something to do with an ex, hearing from an ex. Um, or it could be that someone is now free and single so that you guys can be together. Um, hmm. I feel like the sun is the renewal. Like this is when this is after the after effects of something like something was dead and now it's coming back to life uh, or there's some sort of re regeneration of something. Um, if there was a lot of back and forth, I feel like there's going to be a release from that struggle. I feel like someone's being relieved of a broken heart. I feel like the sun comes out. Um, so like the song, the sun will come out tomorrow. So I feel like maybe someone was had experienced something sad or devastating or a heartbreak, but now the sun is coming out. So someone's going to be healed from some sort of letdown or, you know, something that didn't, something that didn't go so well in the past. And I also see that something, there was a delay in something. I feel like someone was trying to travel or someone was trying to take a trip, but the plans were delayed. And the hanged man is actually showing faced up. So I feel like whatever these delays were are no more. Or someone has now been able to release an ex. Whatever was holding your holding you back romantically, I feel like you're able to move forward now. Um, if it's not romantic, if it's just about something in regards to you being creative, like you had a creative block, I feel like that you're being relieved of it. You're not going to be blocked anymore. Your creative juices will be flowing. You're going to have a lot of new creative ideas. If you felt like your career was blocked or something was blocking you from leaving a place that you didn't want to be in, I feel like that that blockage is going to be removed. But overall, I, you know, it just looks like so much uh, happiness in your reading. I feel like there is a secret. There's a secret that you're unaware of. Um and you're going to be surprised by something or some some people are trying to surprise you is basically what I'm getting overall. So I'm going to pull some energy cards. All right, additional messages for earth signs, 
Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising for this Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Okay, so there is some sort of new plan in place. Um, okay, we have the world. We have door to romance. We have happy family. And we have strategy. Um, so something came to an end with the world. I feel like there was some sort of completion of something. I also feel like you may be on a brink of something, on a brink of change. This also looks like you're uh, at an angle where you have a bigger perspective of everything. Um, you have some sort of view. You have the uh, view on something that was once eclipsed to you. You didn't know how something was going to turn out. You didn't know how to how you were going to get to your destination this I feel like this is something that you're trying to get to and this is you trying to figure out how do you get from here to here maybe there's a long distance relationship and maybe that's what all the secret planning has been about but um, we do have door to romance so I feel like the door whatever blockages there were has come to an end and the doors are swinging open for you to have something that you wanted or something that you were desiring um, I do feel like it's romance based or based off of family uh, either way is dealing with matters of the heart or things that make you feel passionate things that make you feel good um, I feel like something's being saved too. Like someone has been preserving their heart for you or you have been preserving your heart for someone. And I just see the doorway swinging open to that. You're you're getting ready to uh, you know, experience love. There's some sort of big fulfillment here. Something's going to seem like you're going to feel like this is the ideal relationship or this is the ideal family situation. This is very ideal for me. And I feel like you are going to just overall have a sense of of love over the weekend, like sharing time with your friends, your family or a loved one, a romantic partner. You may have had to make new plans in regards to a family trip. It may be that your strategy paid off. Like remember the Seven of Swords looked like someone was sneaking to do something. So even though th there was some sort of a strategic lie, I feel like it pays off. Um, hmm. And then too, I don't know if someone is in the military like where all the there's constantly having to travel or some people are considering getting married so that you can bring your partner with you so that your partner can travel everywhere with you what is that they call military families um i don't want to does it have the word rat in it <laughs> i forgot what it is but it's it's something that military families are called because they have to pack up and move and travel all the time um I'm kind of feeling like there's someone that's in the military that is possibly preparing some sort of engagement so that their love interest can travel with them or because you are traveling so much while you're in one of these places or this country, uh, you may end up meeting uh, the love of your life or an ideal partner. But for the most part, I feel that I feel like you're going to have some sort of completion, some sort of fulfillment from all ends, from all angles. Like everything just looks like it's playing out in your favor. Um, I feel like someone had to play mind games to get what they wanted. Um, 
I also feel like somebody also had to fight to get what they wanted or fight to make something work. Um, like someone had to say, for instance, you were getting denied. Like I was saying something about the trip travel plans getting um, delayed. It could be that you had to fight and prove that you know you had the funds to travel or you had to prove that you were who you said you were with your passport maybe the, there was some sort of mix up on your uh, passport or on your ID something that you were trying to get so that you could travel and I feel that whatever it was that you were denied you fought for it and then it, it opens a lot of doors because you put your foot down I hope that makes sense Hmm. And I also feel like I said that someone is helping or assisting you achieve something. Some sort of secret, some, some sort of plan of action that you had. Other people have been assisting you. <sighs> okay, I hope that makes sense. That felt that reading felt crazy, but um, feel free to leave your comments. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Many blessings to you.